Deadpool and Wolverine was one of the most anticipated movies of 2024, but it did face some criticism from critics and fans for its R rating. MoviesGuide.org says that, the, that Marvel was fla floundering trying to find a new audience with this R rated movie. The article continues to go on bashing Disney and Marvel for its R rating thing. It was out of line for both of them. But is it really that big of a deal? Ryan Reynolds, one of the stars of the movie, said that he's really proud of Disney for doing this in Marvel and that it's a big step in the right direction. He continues in the article stating his opinion and I agree with it. For the first two Deadpool movies that were under Fox, there was no criticism or hate that they were R-rated. And Disney and Marvel have been making steps in the past year to show growth in this realm as well. With Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2, which came out May of last year, dropping the first F-bomb in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. And then Echo in October, the Disney Plus show, getting the first TVMA rating. And I think these two shows and movies were to pre prepare audiences for this new R-rated movie. I understand it's people's concerns for an R-rated movie, especially from a company that's never produced an R-rated movie with Mar the Marvel Cinematic Universe, but I don't think it's that big of a deal. With Deadpool, you expect a funny, campy character that needs to be, have a flexible range that can allow his character to be himself. For the WBUZ, I'm Connor Babcock.